What's going on Lego Maniacs? It's Ty, the Lego guy here, and welcome to another Lego Star Wars review. Today we're taking a look at the original 1999 Wave and reviewing specifically the speeder bike set. That's model 7128. It had 93 pieces, three minifigures, retailed for 10 USD, and it came out in 1999. Now nowadays it's going for 64 new or 28 used and I have a ton of nostalgia for this model. I remember seeing it on shelves when I was a little dude, bought it immediately, you got an awesome Luke Skywalker along with some interesting looking speeder bikes. We're obviously going to take a look at this set's positives and negatives and see where it stands. A lot of the 99 wave was quite rough, we'll see if that's the case with this one, but enough talk, let's get right into it. And to begin, we'll start by taking a look at a very clumpy tree. If there's one thing that dates this set, it's most likely going to be this build. It's not terrible, it's just, you know, very blocky. They use a lot of these three-leafed plants, which I think look quite good. In case you guys, uh, I don't know if you guys have ever experienced this, but I find these break all the time. They're very fragile. In fact, in my collection, I have a special bag where I'm putting all these pieces just because I think I've had probably at least 20 of them break on me. But anyways, overall, pretty decent looking little tree. It is clumpy, but it kind of sets the tone for the atmosphere, I guess, to the set. And it gives something for Luke to kind of stand on. Let's now take a look at the speeder bikes. And here we have one of the two speeder bikes that are included in this model. For the time, this looks quite sleek, like, I don't think that you'd be hard pressed to kind of improve on this if you're using just sets that or pieces that were available back in 1999. And one thing I'd highly recommend Lego kind of do is include some clear pieces. These three clear pieces aren't included, but they just make the speeder bike look so, so cool. I do believe that this piece that they use in the front here, that was a newly designed piece for the time and it just works really, really well for the front of it. There's a reason why they're still using it on speeder bikes today. This is what it kind of looks like in landed mode. And uh, yeah, overall, just very, very smart, simple design that they use to make these speeder bikes. I think that they look awesome. Let's now take a look at the minifigures. And here we have the three minifigures that are included. So you get two scout troopers, along with the Endor Luke Skywalker. This Luke Skywalker is exclusive to this set. He's holding that beautiful chrome lightsaber or chrome hilt. They are by far my favorite lightsaber hilts Lego's ever produced. And then give you guys a view of their back torso printing, back face printing, which they have none because this was the late 90s and they didn't really do that back then. But the Scout Troopers do have face printing and I'll just show that off. Kind of odd face printing. They have a visor, which what looks to be a lightsaber in the top right corner of their visors. And then they have uh, just some lips. It is a very weird design, I will say, but I do like the fact that they have face printing rather than no face printing. They kind of did that with future Scout Troopers and then kind of brought it back. Overall, do like these minifigures quite a bit. And they're going for a fair amount, used in good condition or new. Let's now get into the end of the review and get my final thoughts. Well guys, that was my review. Do hope you enjoyed it. This set, in my opinion, aged quite well. If you look at the speeder bikes, they look somewhat similar to what we got even like five, 10 years later. Not exactly the way they make them now. A lot of times they use bike pieces or they're just a little bit more specialized. There's more smaller pieces to kind of make the speeder bike. But I think for 99, this was very, very good. The tree is whatever, it's a tree. But overall, I think that this aged quite well. I think the minifigure for Luke Skywalker was awesome. The Scout Trooper, they used the Scout Trooper years and years, like I believe at least 10, over 10 years later, they were still using the same type of Scout Trooper. So obviously the minifigure also aged quite well. Overall, I really like this model. I think it was a very fair price for 10 USD and it's probably one of the best age sets from 99 even though it is quite small but let me know what your personal thoughts are on this one if you like it if you don't and uh, any areas you think they could maybe improve on it always interested to hear your guys take but that pretty well does the review but if you liked it leave it a thumbs up and uh, if you're new to the channel you know definitely consider subscribing and click that bell so you're notified for any future lego stars reviews we obviously take a look at them spanning from all the way from 99 to the present and uh, it's definitely one of my favorite type of sets to kind of review since I am a big Star Wars fan. But that's all I got for you again. But thanks again for watching, and I'll catch you 
on the next one.